Hello, family. Thank you for coming over to the house tonight. And just kick off your shoes and relax your feet. Party on down to the SKB. We're kicking. Just kick it. Just kick it. Okay, you don't come to another episode where we're going to be asking the question of... Why are you telling my business? Don't be telling my business. Hmm. Why not? Because a can-can and a can-can, a can-can, a can-can, and a wheel. Now we're off to... Hello, family, and welcome back to the channel. And it's Friday. Here I go, here I go, here I go. It's Friday, y'all. It's Friday. Here I go, here I go. You requested me. Mm -mm -mm. Here I go. You requested me to be on YouTube today. Hello. Oh. What's going on? What's going on? Happy Friday night. Hopefully, you're entertaining yourself or you're getting that needed rest or you're doing housework. Whatever you're doing, you're thinking of me and because I'm thinking of you. Okay? But I had to come in real quick. You try to figure out, Portia, why did you approve? Why did you approve all the time, your glorified boyfriend, to post such craziness? Why did you allow that? I know he was supposed to be getting permission from you before he posts anything. And then I noticed that you were under his um, feed or in the comment section approving what this pastor was trying to say. But I'm like, if you're operating in the realm of godly love, hey... You're going to be well respected. You won't be disrespected. If you're doing what you're supposed to do as a provider, a husband, you're setting a tone. We are nurturers. Women are nurturers. And we're loving. But how this pastor was trying to separate the two and Father Time jumping on the part where it says respect is what you're supposed to give a man. Well, respect. And love is what you're supposed to give a woman. We come from your rib. Alright. Whatever disregard you want to put on us. We could do the same disregard back on you. Alright. So what was Simon trying to say. With posting this pastor. And talking about respect. What a woman is supposed to give to a man. Portia sure you over there disrespecting him. But let's play what the pastor had to say. For just argument's sake. And and this is another thing. Ladies, love is your big word. You will understand that most men never asked you to love us. We ask you to respect us. Because to us, psychologically, when you respect us, we automatically feel loved. We don't we don't need you to buy us flowers. If you respect us, we feel loved. If you disrespect us, we feel hated. That's not your keyword. Your word is love. And we got to learn how to do that better. But we have to understand that 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 plane lands on two different runways from man to woman. For us, it's respect. Respect is actually love. And when we feel disrespected, it feels like hate. Am I right, brothers? All right. And, and this is another thing. Ladies, love is your big word. You will understand that most men never asked you to love us. We ask you to respect us. Us to us. Okay, and then we're gonna put that pastor on hold. Okay, we're gonna put put really put him out to pastor is what we're gonna do. Because like I said, if you're operating from the realm of godly love and you're filled with the Holy Spirit and you're filled with the love, grace, mercy that the Lord provides for us on a continuous basis. 
every 365 days of the year that you are b woken up by his grace and mercy you're supposed to already be on that type of platform simon I'm like, is Portia over there disrespecting you? Is she trying to run your household? Is she trying to wear the pants? Huh, because I saw that awful outfit that you and her were matched in. Those paisley colors that made me think about Easter, the Easter bunny, and the Teletubbies that I told you. You reminded me of Poe, the Teletubbies. <laughs> Child, please. I was wondering why when um, Portia was over there at... Um, um, what her name? Quad Webb's birthday party. Why she didn't take a front part of her dress? The front part. We were only seeing her from angles to the side. Like, did you mess up your dress? Girl in the front. And that was a really covering dress for you. Because you usually show a lot more skin. It's you and uh, Father Time fussing on, about your outfits. And them becoming a little bit too uh, showy. Where you're not leaving too much to the imagination uh is he demanding that you wear you cover yourself up now Portia because that I was like wait a minute it wasn't cold that day wasn't windy uh why does she have on this long shirt of a dress and it's covering up her I'm like damn girl that's what you should have been doing in the first place covering up your assets only for your man or your husband to be seen. Not the world. You ain't no centerfold for porno or something to that degree. You ain't one of the uh, bunnies that Hugh Hefner used to have over there at his camp. You're not a Playboy bunny. All right. You're not a porn star. Um, and so why would you need to show so much skin and so much tits all the time? So that really kind of threw me off when I saw that picture. I'm like, now. Push on a dress this way when she's trying to act more mature and act more like a woman and have some oomph about herself. Okay, so uh, what, what, why were we getting that girl? Because everybody else was showing skin. You know what I'm saying? Well, Sheree wasn't. Okay, and Cynthia wasn't either. Cynthia was pretty much a little underdressed for me. Am I looking at the optics that the uh, the pictures were being showed or displayed for our viewing? But I'm like, girl, did you make Father Time mad, honey? Because he feels he needs to get with this Pastor Keon. And the title he gave his uh video, Men Feel Love When Respected in Relationships. I'm like, okay, hold on for one. Both man and woman should be respected regardless. Okay, it's just not a one-way street. It's not, I am the man. You're going to do what I, has, I say and this, that, third. Because we talking about a godly man. We can't follow men. And, and, and get thrown off the cliff. You see what I'm saying? We got to see your walk and your talk. Mostly your actions towards a particular situation. Or just living life. Period. We got to see if you can lead. Because sometimes men and women will lead your ass right off a cliff. If you let them. So no, 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 no. We over here at the house. We do our due diligence. Okay. We vet. Meaning we screen. We look into a person's background. Who we trying to mess with. And be asking for the social security number so we can see how the credit is standing, okay? Or do have they had any infractions with the law where they had to go behind them bars and stay, you know, for a little spell, <laughs> okay? We have to know these things, all right? Especially if we're trying to get involved with you. We're trying to build with you. We're trying to marry you, you know? Ha, ha, ha. Honey, honey, looky, looky, who comes cooking? And I was like, wait a minute. What in the knickknack, patty whack, give a dog a bone is going on over here? Is it trouble in paradise, Portia? Is it trouble in paradise? Because you had said so yourself. You got to approve. You got to um, uh, approve anything that um, your glorified boyfriend, Father Time, posts. Because it can be a reflection on you if he does something stupid. And, of course, I guess stupid is a stupid does because you were under his, as you can see, uh, at the bottom of this um, video image. It says, Light by Portia, real, Portia for Real. Okay, and I'm like, girl, why are you co-signing this shit? Everybody deserves respect. Hell, a dog res deserves respect. Okay, and if they got to get that ass tapped here and there, 
uh it has to happen you know what i'm saying we don't want men and women fighting at all but you know you could you you can you can hurt a man in a lot of different ways and i ain't talking about cheating but you can make it known that okay you're gonna do me like that well i'm gonna do you like this okay until we come to an understanding and an agreement we're gonna be at war with one another okay but honey i'm like girl simon 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 honey 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 you come from woman, okay? So you really should be respecting us. We are definitely the diva and the creator of uh, of men and women coming into the world. Because last I had checked, men cannot, uh, a biological man cannot hold a child for nine months and give birth to them through their vaginal canal where the baby gonna come, come out out your ass or something oh simon so i think you need to honor us and we be very well reserved okay preserved and observed okay we need all of that and then some all right so i don't know where you came with this foolishness i don't know why porsche co-signed it but it's a hot mess okay men get respected each and every day especially the men of color same with the women we get disrespected on two platforms for being a woman and trying to um attain many lucrative professional jobs that most men only hold or held we're breaking down the glass ceiling we're forging ahead we're making it do what it do because some men don't want to take care of their responsibility they don't want to be in a committed relationship they don't want to be married unless they had fringe benefits where they could tip out have a pass haul to do this you know maybe three times a year to keep the spice in somebody's marriage but no 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 that's a satanic way of thinking okay when you get married when you say you found your king your queen y'all become one that means everything that y'all do and think about is as one y'all are the united front when them kids come involved that you don't brought into the world you still be one okay they can't go between parents and think they're gonna get something different no it becomes you all as one one unity one front going out to the masses like whatever hurts you should hurt partial unless it was some infringement going on and fractions being made and you can't co-sign even though it's hard y'all supposed to have that united front you can't get with that that atmosphere that attitude that environment or that stance they took you see what i'm saying saying sign mine because right now you're disrespecting portia because you shouldn't be shacking living with her trying to lease her while you're thinking about buying her that is a total disrespect you're doing to her now okay we don't like the shacking okay because common law marriage is not even upheld in atlanta georgia anymore and it probably is not in the rest of the other states okay but you're disrespecting her all right and both of y'all really need to sit y'all asses down somewhere because both of y'all are not good at marriage yeah you, know, you don't had three failed marriages portia done had one trying to make it on number two even though she was calling herself being engaged to Dennis. Well, we know where that went. But a baby was produced out of that union. And you became her stepfather. Or would become her stepfather. Now, what are you going to do as she continues to get older? And she's seeing you still with her mama. Still not married. Still having a farce of a relationship. Saying, oh, I love her. She's my queen. She's G Miss Gabadia. No, she ain't until you put it on paper. The judge witnesses and sign off of it. And you can pick it up in the clerk's office in any kind of courthouse downtown in Atlanta. Okay, baby. Then that becomes a legal document binding contract that you have. So before you put another stupid ass post up here, Simon, you need to really run it by maybe one of your colleagues at your job maybe one of your friends okay who has to stand so woman and man are together as one instead of you saying and listening to this pastor trying to differentiate whether uh women are made to love that's y'all keyword and for a man respect is 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 reserved by a man hell no nah, they go hand in hand simultaneously for both entities for a man and for a woman so get it right do right be right simon gabadia father time 
aka Papa Smurf. Get it right before you post something on social media that's making you look even crazier for the negative out here in these social media streets. Now I've spoken. Now I need my family to get down there and speak. Because here I go. Here I go. Here I go. Back to another video. Okay. I'll see y'all next time. Bye-bye.